एवरीवन दिस इज स्टैंडर्ड सिक्स वीडियो नंबर टू साइंस इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर ऑफ चैप्टर ट्वेल्व दैट इज इलेक्ट्रिसिटी एंड सर्किट्स ओके वी आर प्रोसीडिंग टूवर्ड्स द क्वेश्चन आंसर अंडरस्टैंडिंग आइडियाज पेज नंबर वन एटी थ्री आंसर द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन इन वन वर्ड और वन सेंटेंस The first question moving towards a name name a common device which produces electricity from the chemicals stored inside it the answer is dry cell okay dry cell is also called electric cell okay at the cell consists of an outer covering made up of zinc at the center of the container a carbon rod with a metallic cap that is made up of brass okay this carbon rod is surrounded by a mixture of magnesium dioxide here it is magnesium dioxide and powdered charcoal that is carbon pure carbon and remaining space inside the zinc container is filled by with a thick paste of ammonium chloride thick paste of ammonium chloride the outer side of the zinc container is covered with a cardboard cover except the bottom the cell is sealed except the metallic brass cap and the base the tip of the cell that is metallic cap acts as a positive terminal and the base of the zinc container acts as a negative terminal here you can see this is the positive and this is negative terminal okay when we connect the tip of the metal cap and the base of the zinc can can with a metal wire the current flows through it now we are moving towards the second question that is which part of the torch bulb gives off light when it is connected to a cell of a wire the answer is filament and this filament is made up of a tungsten whose symbol is w okay it is used in the bulb because it has high melting point 3410 degree celsius high resistivity it do not melt easily so tungsten is used in the filament now moving to the third question that is name a safe source of electricity for performing science experiment in the school laboratory that is the safe source is dry cell we can use because the elect the current which flows has a constant it do not give fluctuation and high voltage so we can do safe practicals from the dry cell moving toward the next question that fourth one a torch bulb and a cell has two terminals in which case the two terminals are not marked with positive and negative just now you have seen that uh, the dry cell i am talking about the cell has two parts that is positive and negative upside positive and downside negative so dry cell contains positive terminal and negative terminal but what happen in the bulb you will not see the positive and negative terminals so the answer will be torch bulb now moving towards the fifth question that give the scientific name of a material which allows electric current to pass through them the scientific mater scientific material is called conductor okay and conductors are those material which allows electric current to flow through them okay i have written some good conductors that nail iron nail is a good conductor copper is a good conductor paper clip is a good conductor scissor 
uh, which is a good conductor graphite pencil lead this is an exception graphite is an exception because only non metal which conduct electricity very important question okay drinking water okay good conductor lemon juice good conductor milk mercury that is a good conductor so your answer here given the conductors moving towards the question number 6 that is what is the negative terminal of the cell made up of okay the negative terminal of the cell dry cell is made up of zinc yes where is the negative terminal this side is the negative terminal this is the, uh, the positive terminal this is the zinc coating okay this is a negative terminal now moving towards the next question seventh one that name a device which is used to open or close a circuit the device is known as switch an electric switch is a simple device that is used to open or close an electric circuit switch comes in the various shapes and size sometimes a switch is also referred to as a key in an electric circuit okay here you can see this is the open circuit and this is closed circuit sometimes it shown with the like this this is the circuit that is closer closed circuit okay and open circuit is upside it shows it does not touch the this portion so it is open and this is closed it is touching moving towards the next question that is 81 the question is what is the scientific name of the material which does not allows electric current to pass through them that is insulators insulator are the material that resist or block the movement of electrons they do not allow the current to pass through them the examples here is wood glass plastic in the previous uh, slide also i have shown you some insulators that is wood wool rubber plastic vinegar honey fuel distilled water glass these are the bad conductor of that is insulators thank you thank you very much